Hi, welcome to The Crypto Lifestyle. At this channel, we focus on mass adoption, decentralization, and other aspects of cryptocurrency that'll bank you coin. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. You can find out when we post our next video and leave a comment. We love reading the comments. Also, hit the link to all our socials, Twitter, Facebook, Medium. Please join the community. We'd really appreciate it. Thank you so much to all the TCLers out there. We appreciate every single one of you. I am the Crypto Lifer. I also have my own YouTube channel, Crypto Lifer. The link is in the description and pinned in the comment section below. I do a live stream every single day from 9.30 to 11.30, Monday through Friday, and Saturday and Sunday nights at 8 p.m. That is 14 hours of live streaming every single week and videos like this as well. So head over to my channel and subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. In this channel, we always look at the different angles of cryptocurrency, and we always try to find the best blockchains that can propel us into decentralization for the masses, mass adoption. We need technology for mass adoption, and we need speed. This next blockchain I'm gonna talk about has those and more. Another thing about this blockchain is that it is built from the ground up. Its code is super independent and unique. Unlike other tokens like ERC20 tokens that get built off the original codes of Ethereum. You may have heard of this chain, but the crypto life is about to break it down like he always does. So Francis, take it away with the intro and let's get in to the Phantom Network. <laughs> Ooh, I love that intro. It gets me every single time. But without further ado, let me shrink myself into the bottom left corner, let you see the screen, and let's get in to the Phantom Network. There's one thing I have to disclose. We here at The Crypto Lifestyle are not financial advisors. Please get yourself a financial advisor and do your own research before getting into any coin or project. So The Phantom Network, what makes it so unique? What makes it so special? Why? Phantom. Well, number one, it was created a little while after a lot of other blockchains. So they could see what the issue was with scalability and speed. And they said, you know what? Let's fix it. I think it solves both of those issues very, very well. It's one of the first direct acyclic graphs of its kind. Now it runs a consensus and it does not run on proof of work like Bitcoin. It actually is a lot more environmentally friendly than a lot of the other chains out there as well. On top of all this, it has its own unique technology called Lachesis, if I'm saying that correct. And it uses its own unique asynchronous Byzantine fault tolerance. This gives it the ability to do 300,000 transactions a second. 300,000 transactions a second. Yes, you heard that right. 300,000 transactions a second. Unbelievable. Right now, I think Visa does 2,000 transactions a second. So you can only think of how much better blockchain could make commerce. If all of us could have more transactions faster, more money will be less locked up in liquidity to do transactions and the world will move even quicker and there'll be more money around at all given times. Even if it takes one minute for my credit card transaction to go through, which we know takes a lot longer between the swift settlements and everything behind. If this could do 300,000 in a second and you know they get cleared immediately on the blockchain. So bing, this would be unbelievable guys. This would change the way the whole entire world works. When you look at Phantom, they're talking about running smart cities from front to back. They could even do supply chain. You can use Phantom for so many different applications. It's absolutely endless. So how does Phantom work? Well, Lecce's represents one layer, the consensus of the blockchain technology stack, and you can be plugged into any distributed ledger. Phantom's mainnet is called the Opera mainnet. Yes, Opera. I don't know if it's like the Phantom of the Opera maybe. Hmm, probably. Pretty interesting, right? It's funny how they did these play on words in blockchain. I love it. And everything about Phantom is kind of spooky. They got Frankenstein, Spirit Swap, Spooky Swap. We're going to get into those swaps in a few minutes from now. And we're gonna get into their DeFi ecosystem as well. We're gonna show you a little bit about how to move Phantom around, how I personally got Phantom into my MetaMask wallet, and how you could get the Opera Mainnet on your MetaMask wallet, how you can get Phantom in there, and how you can get staking Phantom right away. The modularity of the Opera Mainnet makes it extremely flexible. Developers can port their existing Ethereum-based dApps on the Phantom Opera Mainnet in a matter of minutes substantially upgrading the performance and lowering the cost. So if you built a dApp on Ethereum and you wanna just swing it right over to Phantom, by all means, come on in. This could change the game. I'm telling you right now, you see how big Ethereum is and you see how much the ecosystem has grown and you see how much fees it gets on Uniswap. I mean, I paid over $2,000 in fees when I went to fees.wtf. You can find out how many ETH fees you've paid. It's crazy. Phantom would never do that. One Phantom, I believe, which is worth about 28 cents today, 
could render you of almost a thousand transactions. The transactions are a hundred to a thousands of a penny. They are just tiny. I don't see any other blockchain even close. Matic comes close, but I think Phantom is even cheaper and even more scalable than Matic. So each network built on Phantom is independent from one another. Their performance and scalability are unaffected by traffic or congestion. It does not matter. You're not gonna see the CryptoKitties bog down that I talked about in my last video with Ethereum. So the deal with blockchains is, no matter how scalable you are, the more complex dApps you add and the increase of users, the whole network will slow down. This happens because the dApps use the same infrastructure and it's similar to executing multiple applications on one computer. That computer will eventually bog down and it won't be able to handle it. So Phantom solved the scalability by giving each application its own blockchain, similar to running each application on different computers. So right now I'm online, I'm watching some trades and I'm recording this video. It's all bogging down my computer. But on Phantom, that would all be done on a separate computer. That's how your brain can kind of look at this and outline it so you can understand how Phantom works. I always try to bring you, the viewer, the complexity of blockchain, but I do also want to show you the common way we can understand it because it's hard for us to get our heads wrapped around all this stuff. Direct acyclic graph, right? Asynchronous Byzantine fault tolerance. There's a lot of words getting thrown at you. But just know, it's similar to running multiple applications on multiple computers, so you don't bog down the network. If we think of Ethereum as a decentralized computer, Phantom is a network made up of a potentially infinite number of decentralized computers. They all share the same logic, but they're completely independent of one another. Yet, they can easily communicate with each other. In other words, Phantom is a network of networks. You get it? Instead of having one network bogged down, Phantom is multiple networks made into one network. Very interesting. Phantom is secure and environmentally friendly. Unlike Bitcoin and Ethereum, which run on proof of work, Phantom runs on proof of stake. This stops centralization because when there's proof of work, you could have all the miners in one area. Having all the miners in one area or under one jurisdiction can centralize a blockchain. This cannot happen with Phantom. Already decentralization, the very number one goal of this channel. The consensus mechanism can also scale to hundreds of nodes, increasing decentralization, therefore security. The more nodes you have, the more secure you have. The faster the network and the more scalable, the faster you can add nodes. So this can actually grow to be more scalable and more secure faster than any other blockchain. Look at it like a race, because it is a race. This blockchain can expand faster than other blockchains because it can be made faster, it can move faster, it can actually live in a faster environment. Phantom is made for speed, infinite speed. Lastly, Lachesis is leaderless. By removing the leaders, security doesn't rely on a small set of actors. It can kind of continue to grab the information as it's formed. Phantom is also open source. They're committed to creating building blocks to use to customize anyone's needs. So I just broke down why Phantom is amazing, why I think you should invest in it. But let's break down DeFi on Phantom. That's right, Phantom is not without a robust DeFi space. Think about it. If each space creates its own DeFi ecosystem and Phantom is the coin that runs that ecosystem and it only costs one thousandth of a penny to do most of these transactions, then how many more transactions can people do using the Phantom Network, thousands more. More people can be staking at one time, more people can be earning at one time, and more farms can be out there producing more passive income. So I think Phantom's the place to be. Now let's look at the unique aspects that make Phantom DeFi interesting. Right off the bat, you can get started instantly. Access DeFi right from your wallet, start trading and lending. There's no registration needed. You're always in control of your keys and you can trade from your computer or your personal device. It's fully decentralized. You can also unlock a whole new way of decentralized trading. Transactions on Phantom are almost instant and cost a fraction of a penny. It's pretty cool, man. Then you can mint FUSD with FMint. FMint is the gateway to Phantom DeFi. Mint FUSD, the stablecoin on Phantom, and it's pegged one-to-one -to, -one to USD pricing using your Phantom. Choose the amount you want to mint, rebalance at any time by adding or removing Phantom. Repay the FUSD you minted at any time, unlocking your Phantom. It's pretty cool, pretty interesting. So you mint FUSD using your Phantom. There's a 500% collateral ratio, and you can rebalance at any time. On top of that, you can trade on Synths on FSwap. Trade 176 synthetic tokens, including FBTC and FETH. Fully decentralized trading, no slippage. Trade without leaving your wallet. Truly decentralized trading. 
This is really cool, guys. Buy and sell synthetic assets directly from your Phantom wallet. Use your Phantom or FUSD to trade 176 assets that represent tokens outside of the Phantom ecosystem. You can trade Bitcoin, Ethereum, and many other cryptocurrencies. Do you think Bitcoin will increase in value in the short term? Then you buy FBTC. Sell it after it pumps. So you could trade FBTC for FUSD. This is just like trading USDT for Bitcoin on your Binance account, but now you're in the decentralized world paying zero fees and having the transactions absolutely instant. This is amazing. Every week, I get to bring you guys the coolest topics on the blockchain. And these are chains I'm heavily heavily passionate about and that I'm heavily invested in. Again, this is not financial advice, but I personally think I would be a fool not to be invested in the Phantom Network. I mean, look at what's going on. 28 cents? 28 cents. That is the most undervalued coin in the game, in my opinion. In the game. Now, after everything I've told you about Phantom, you can see that it's definitely the ideal platform for global solutions. And it can have a multitude of use cases not just one or two, it could do many, many things. Look, it could be used in the financial markets. Like right now, you could put Phantom onto the stock market, literally, and do all your transactions on Phantom. You can synthesize any asset. You can synthesize Tesla, call it F Tesla. You can synthesize FAMC, anything you want, and then trade super fast, super scalable. So you could use it right now as an exchange for any exchange around the world. It could basically run the NASDAQ. Then you could have an institutional clearing and settlement. It can clear money way faster than the SWIFT system we have right now that's clearly outdated. It could be a central bank digital currency if it really needed to be one. It's decentralized finance. It can tokenize real estate. It can even be used for smart healthcare and track your medical records. And a supply chain manager. It can be great for that as well. To me, it competes with a multitude of other coins because there's some coins that just do each of those things. This does it all. Phantom's amazing. Now, if you just got excited about Phantom and you want to interact with it right away, I understand. So let me show you. You could get your MetaMask wallet. Go to MetaMask.io if you don't know what MetaMask is. You can download a wallet. You can make it an extension on your Google Chrome or your Brave browser. When you set it up, it'll ask you for a password, which you'll create, and it will give you a 12-word seed phrase. You're just going to write this down. It's going to make you re-repeat it back in a different order. You're going to do that so it knows that you wrote down your seed phrase, and then it's going to open up a wallet for you. Please keep the seed phrase away from anyone else. Do not let anyone have it. They will be able to access your funds with that seed phrase. So do not lose it. Make sure it's in a safe place and don't let anybody have it. You can always go to chainlist.org right here, type in phantom. You can connect your wallet here and then add this to your MetaMask. Then I've already done that. And you can see when I go to my mainnet and I scroll down, I have the phantom opera mainnet. And what do you know? I have 122 phantom waiting in my wallet for me pretty cool how did i get phantom into my wallet i made an extensive video about that on my channel if you want to check it out but i'll also tell you really quick i opened up a binance account i ended up buying phantom with bitcoin or any stable coin and then you can send phantom from binance on the phantom opera mainnet right to your metamask wallet just make sure you're picking the mainnet when you send it from binance to your MetaMask wallet. Now, once you have Phantom in your wallet, you can interact with all the amazing DeFi projects that are going on on the Phantom network. Here's one called Spirit Swap. Spirit's five cents right now, and there's some good returns on the farming. If we go over and check the farming right now, there is 136% gains with 5.4 liquidity here on the Spirit Phantom LP. If you don't know what an LP is, please watch a video on how to make an LP token and how to farm. I also have a video about impermanent loss on my channel, which will tell you basically what you're getting into when you make an LP token and decide to farm. Then we have Spooky Swap. This is basically the pancake swap of Phantom. At $3.40, who knows, but you could see Spooky Swap do some crazy, crazy things. Right here, you connect your wallet, hit MetaMask, and now you're connected. I could stake Phantom and Boo for 210% APR. That's not bad. And there's $6 million in liquidity in here already. There's a FUSD Phantom, a USDC Phantom, Phantom Dai, Phantom Ave, Phantom Link, Phantom BNB, Phantom Wrapped ETH, wow, the list goes on. Even Curve Finance up in there, Phantom Badger, even Phantom Beefy. So awesome stuff out here. I really like what we're seeing. Now the rates are competitive, but even if the rates were the same at another farm, it's way faster here and you're paying less than a penny, hundreds of a tenth of a penny just to get these transactions done. So it's easy. One Phantom you could use for hundreds and hundreds of transactions. It's amazing. And Phantom's 28 cents. It blows my mind every time I think about how much I can yield farm on Phantom. 
And then there's Frankenstein pool. As you can see, everything is Halloween and horror. It's so funny. I actually like it, man. It's pretty cool. Then there's Hyper Jump on the Phantom Network. And look at this, 515% APR for ORI and Phantom. ORI USDC has 529%. Wow, so not only is it cheap to use Phantom, but they also have an amazing competitive rates. Like, this is crazy. These are some high rates on these farms. 40x multiplier, 10x multiplier. Then I just jumped into the Star Vaults and I'm looking at 1.3% a day, 1.4% a day. Those are some amazing rates to make 1.4% a day of passive income. So if you've ever used PooCoin, this is basically the PooCoin for Phantom, but it's called ZooCoin. It's the classier form, obviously. Who wants to say PooCoin when you can say ZooCoin? I mean, duh. So this is also ready to go. You're gonna be able to take any of your Phantom coins Paste in the address, chart it, look what's going on. So ZooCoin on the Phantom Network, they're ready to rock, man. They got the apps ready to rock. It's also going to be a Phantom-based asset dashboard, advanced asset tracking, staking and liquidity providing for Phantom investments, and portfolio analytics. It's going to be awesome. Right now, I'm going to connect my wallet to the ZooCoin wallet and see what's going on. And look, there's my famous number, the 33. Follows me everywhere I go. $30.33 of Phantom in here, 122 Phantom. And then it has all the assets. It tracks how much they've gone up and down. Wow, there's a lot of stuff. We got Shiba, Bomb, Cream, Cover. As they said, 176 different assets right now are on the Phantom mainnet. Oh my gosh, there's so much about Phantom. I probably couldn't even cover it all in one video. But I hope I at least gave you guys a big picture into what's going on with the Phantom Network. Look at all the farms that you can get some good yield action on. Look at the cheap fees and look at all the different use cases Phantom has. As just an investment, I believe Phantom has a place in any cryptocurrency enthusiast portfolio. After all my research and after being in crypto for about five years, I have a strong feeling that Phantom is gonna become one of the biggest gainers in my portfolio. Thank you so much for watching us here at The Crypto Lifestyle. Please comment, like, and subscribe. Hit the bell for notifications. You can find out when we post our next video. And remember, until next time, you're on your own. <laughs>